And as the sun rises, we take a look at our not so beautiful building. How's it going everybody? Kata here. Welcome back to Satisfactory. Here is what I have from the previous episode of the beginnings that we had with this iron factory of sorts over here. The back of it's still done. Um, yes, so this thing up the side here is a bit of an issue. I will not be able to do anything about that. I think later down the line, I might actually redo this building again. Or just put it somewhere else. Unless I can get rid of this rock eventually. I don't think I can. But that's the whole reason things are like this. Um, we have this little cool conveyor belt dual system here. For taking things up. I have two of them. This one has two of the iron lanes going up there. They are, these things are just everywhere. I should probably get out of camera mode. Can you actually pick that one up? Cool. Um, but yeah, we, I have all of the iron wrench melted. It's all not going anywhere because we have yet to connect the power up above yet. But it's all getting 30. Producing 30 all along here, so it's all even Stevens. And we just take it up to the top, so I can climb a convenient ladder. And then I will fall down, because momentum is kept. And then, we have this monstrosity of a place. I don't think I really get up on top of anywhere. Do a good view of it, but it's just four constructors in a line. These four on this side are making the rods from just the one source of iron. Because that's how it splits out. And then I had this side doing the iron plates. I only had these two initially. And then I might as well just make the plates because there's no reason not to. And then they all converge both sides together. They can all fit onto the one conveyor belt because it's all 15 without a uh, item and then can I squeeze through here I cannot all right well me getting up there go from the middle da -da 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 -da. I just have them going into separate storages and then we're going to do some of we're going to do the rotors the combinings and all the stuff up here actually and making all of the screws because that hasn't happened yet now the moment of truth are we going to run out of power by doing this? Because all of them are turning on at once. No. We could potentially peek over because this was sitting on 80 before. But we shall... We shall see. Now that all of this is running smoothly. Shouldn't have any backups down here either. And it should be just constant flow... Once they all merge in together of roads and iron plates. And here they are arriving into their storage units almost at the same time. So now I can actually, with the also mass production of these, I'll be able to build up the rest of the walls. I was going to say foundations, but the foundations only require concrete, which I'm going to have to increase the storage over there. I might not have to if I'm going to be using it because that almost filled up. And that has been running, but not efficiently, while I've been building this. Just to show how well this has kind of been running. We have a lot of the things. That is bananas. I try to plonk that down. No, we won't do that. Nearly five stacks of rotors. And yeah, close to one and a half. There goes the power. I was expecting it to go. It lasted a little bit longer than I thought it would. How much of a jump was it? Not much. And let there be power. That should hopefully give us enough room for now. I will have to go build more of these. Yeah, it was just a little bit jumpy. Uh, they've all got two overpowered sh or shards in them. Um, and it's time... I forgot that that was it. Time to dismantle all of this, but I will do so after I've actually put 
the other constructors of the, the screws and stuff. All the way over there. And... See, this is the thing we're trying to prevent. That from happening when they could just go over there. But anyway. The final piece to the puzzle of our factory is about to go into place. And after a little bit more time than I care to admit, <laughs> we have our big orange box of a factory with not very easy access to get around in it, which I will work on in the future. We have an opening up there, we have a doorway down to the bottom here. Yeah, so this thing's supposed to be 100% efficient. But apparently it's not. That one's fine. Why is the other one having issues? I don't know. But anyway, the reason there's a hole up top is we use a jump pad to bounce our way up here. Whoosh. Um, so we have bottom floor is smelting the iron second floor makes it into the iron plates and the, the rods are we slowly losing rods we might be i'm not too sure if that's no that increased for a second there i have this the mark ii belt to get it out immediately going off that way which i might be able to slow it down. I'll see about that in the future to whether or not okay, that is most definitely losing. So I think at that point it'll just sit steady. It might fill back up. I don't know. Um, then we have two screw productions on this floor. Third floor, which is this one. And that one there. This one gets merged into the iron or the DDDD will have one being made in second. The reinforced iron plates, which realistically I need more of. And the screws. Some of the rods come in from the other side. The fact that it's, it's stopped probably means that I can have slowed it down. And we just climb one of the many ladders that are in here and fail in getting up. It's, it's obnoxious. Like I said, not easy to get around. Look, this one. And that gets into over here. Up to the top to make the rotors, which we have plenty of already, and the modular frames. And just by looking at that, obviously I need to increase the production of the reinforced plates. Actually, I don't 100% know if I need to. I think they might just be coming in quick. They should be coming in just quick enough. But apparently it's not actually. You want 12 per minute. Okay, I have misread that. But anyway, now that I have this sorted out, because this makes 5 per minute. Yeah, okay. So I do need this to be increased. Which the group production is perfect at the moment. So it would be just a case of I would technically need to make more of these but the steady income of them is fine for me although I don't get to use them. The problem here is I take damage from falling so I'm going to throw in a jelly pad but I just need some biofuel. But anyway that is not the f apart from setting that up which was supposed to be done between episodes most of the time. I can't fill that in unless I bulge it out like that because of the, the badges. That was not supposed to be the focus of today. The focus was to get steel production. I'm surprised I haven't run out of power though. Get close. I'm gonna have to make like two more of those in the meantime. Uh, to, because yeah, to get all this stuff, gonna need a lot more power. Uh, and they require things, except for that one. Actually, I can get the combat one any time that I want. Uh, but these ones, we have all the stuff for that. So I shall gather the things and we shall get ourselves into the steel production. Alright, I has all the things. 
need to get into a habit of actually clicking the button so they show up there. Oh, dude. Why? Why did I think it was 15? I don't know. I have more of those than I need. And I definitely have more of those than I need. Then, add... The capers. Rush. You're flying, my beautiful blue mo monster. Steel production unlocked. Foundry and improved miner included to ensure efficiency of new pipelines. A collection of new, more complex parts is now available for crafting. I forgot that the upgraded miner was a part of that. That is beautiful. I don't know if I've seen you take off at that time, and I don't think I've actually paid too much attention to Zenate Sky. Um, I've also made a couple of changes around here as well, of just another adding in another wire station mark 2 belt to just funnel them across but clearly it's not going too fast did the same thing down for the concrete and just extended this across the merge with that so that goes fast up that apparently just non-stop going then if that's the case yeah go on not stop. Awesome. Um, yeah, that's about all I've done. Do I am lost? But anyway, I think I should hook up a little bit more of the coal power because we're written dangerously close. Now, if that's not enough power for what we have to do today, I'll know what will be. But yes, all joking aside, not that I'm really joking with that, I has more than doubled our power. And if it well, was originally, I thought he was floating then. 400 megawatts of power is what we have free available to us at the moment. And none of them have any of the power shards in them. It's just black power. So there's still that to be done. Although, possibly doing that we will... Maybe at that point go over the coal power usage that we have because at the moment it's just we're still having more coal come in than what we can use. Excuse me, but anyway, we have all of our dish stuff to do so steel ingots and such. We make with coal and iron that that'll be interesting so unless I want to get another uh, go to the other I think it was two coal things yeah there's another one down oh this one that way oh no. Yeah, that's the one that I know exists. It's down by the, the water. That we went and looked at exploring that one time. That one I'm not too familiar with. It's just, it's actually just as close, really. Did not realize that those two were actually practically the same uh, closeness together. No, no, no. I don't know what I'm searching for there. I only want the iron. I want to know if there's any iron out that way. Because that would be good to know. Although I don't think my iron searching thing goes as far as other things. You know what, let's take it to buggy. We haven't taken our car for a joyride for a little bit. Let's take that out that, out that way and have a look to see what's going on over there. And I believe you should still have a bunch of fuel in you. You do. I have a bunch of stuff on me which I can actually just dump in here if I need anything else. Anyway, let's tractor away. Hey look, we could also test our shoe shooters. I just jump up here for a second while you, you know, attempt to do the things. Grab that. Hey. Boosh. So one shot and he ran it away. Need to be back. They always come back. Or not. I guess we'll find out how much, how many shots it takes. 
uh, for things later on. Oh, there's another power slug just over the ridge here. And literally gone nowhere. But how close is the coal? It's right there. Yeah, that's pretty, pretty damn close. Okay, that one pinged it. Looked like it came from over there. Is there? Hi guys. Oosh. Hi, hi, hi. There's two of you. There's two of you. And I am failing. Oh, it takes two shots. You should be very, very, very scared, my friend. Kaboosh. Run away. Well, you made yourself stuck. Doesn't matter what game I play. Actually, no, this game more so because it's first person. I see something that's going to hurt me. I'm not going to jump. It's going to, it's a fact of life. Okay, that, I need to bank bridge to get over there then. Good thing I still have a whole bunch of concrete on my person. I didn't realize that it costs the same amount for both of these. But anyway, let's... Try and make a bridge from about there. Please tell me I actually screw that up. Okay, we're cool. And we are sprinting, yes. What dangers await us over here? I didn't make it high enough, but that's fine. Oh, fireball, fireboys. I wanted to press R. You miss, buddy. Pressing all the wrong buttons. Boosh. It still takes, it's gonna take four for you then, is it? It does indeed take four. I'll reload that. I thought I saw second one? No? It's the second one. I don't think that hits you though. Ow, 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 wow, 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 wow. Ooh, hi. I don't need all these other things. He, he can't get to me, so it's fine. Ow. Oh, it sticks into you. You're going to come over here when I least expect it. Or not. Oosh. Well, I believe I hit you. Bonk. I did. Uh, not sure if I'm hearing more things or not. Oh, I am. Oh, and it's the damn, the damn bugs as well. Oh, I can shoot a lot quicker than I think I can. Or thought I could. I pressed E by mistake. We're good. I wonder if I can shoot them from a distance. Or if I can actually shoot them, I should should say. Uh, I shall eat some food because that would be greatly appreciated. Now let's have a test. All the wrong buttons. Um, let me put that there so I know I, whether or not this works or not. Oosh. Oh, that worked. But, uh, hi, bugger, bug, bug, bug. You not interested in me at all? Oh, hi. Hi, 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 hi. Hi. Two more left. So that is a terrible idea to do that. Hap, 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 hap. I didn't hit you, you hit me. Why did you fall over like that? Hap, hap, hoosh. Did it? Nothing else around here? Hello, specimen. Now, I have already... I have found out that these things talk a little bit more than I realized. Talk. I didn't have space to pick you up. But will you talk to me if I don't have space to pick you up? I strongly advise you to harvest this specimen. Yeah... But no. I might wait around that another day to try and hear what else it says. 
Is this coal thing a... It's pure coal. Well, I don't remember what the initial one was, uh, but with production. Miner Mark II and a foundry. Smelts two things together. Gotcha. The stuff required for this. I would love to make this. I forgot that I need to do things. I'll be back. Actually, now I might be back. I will build the first the things together for the first time. You guys. But back at base. Okay, well. I'm gonna quickly grab these power slugs. There's one over there as well. And I will just dump some of that in there. I don't remember if these stack or not. I'll find out. And today. Oh, the wrong buttons they do. And up. So while I'm over here, is there any closer iron? No. Maybe. Double check that when we go back over there. Because it would be better to forge the steel closer to where both of them originate from. Although it also does depend on what type of iron it is. Okay, so what exactly did we need? We needed coal and iron ore, which I actually have on me. So that works out really well. Steel ingots. Or oh, wax for two of them. At least, they, at least they combine together and make two. This is nice enough to have done that. I'm going to just stop at 30. What did we need for the Mother Mark 2? So we need encased industrial beams and steel pipes. Well, if I just did that, it would be up on the side there. Excuse me. Steel beams, which is. It's just both of them, right? Yeah, okay, so it's just a crafting thing for the... Ooh, actually, your steel beams. In case steel beams require steel beams in the... I gotcha. Ooh. I've already run it out. I didn't make enough of it, though. And then your steel pipes. Ooh, I made... Whoa, 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 whoa. Still ink it. I don't have any room. <laughs> I uh, did also so in t I don't know if I'm mis uh, not understanding this correctly but in tier one personal storage unlock storage box I don't know if that was this one or the ability to craft it if it's the ability to craft it I don't have it nor do I know where I craft it from unless it's like something to do with this I am not sure should also research that anyway I need to clear up my inventory all right so we're back I didn't realize the steel beam cost so many steel ingots to make one that's nuts so we need some steel pipes there we get the bar going across to I need to go back and grab the cables the encased industrial beams. Made one too many of those. I don't even have stuff to make a portable mount. No, I don't. Well, the rest is fine. Uh, yeah, that, this is going to require a whole new factory of things. Oh boy. Actually, no, we're going to take a, a little bit of a detour. We're going to get improved melee combat as well. Just so I can, one, clear up some inventory space, but two, get more inventory space. Alright, so the final little bits of wire and cable. Launch that. Improved melee combat. You go flying. Ada speaks. inflated your pocket dimension and have provided an improved Xeno Zapper with increased strength and range. I just love that. Increased your pocket dimension. Inc do the thing with the Xeno Zapper. Why you require two Xeno Zappers? Well, understandable why it I, I just happened to have the stuff on me. For that. Um but because I'm holding it. Aha. 
because I was holding it. And a little bit more wire. And a little bit more copper wire. Cable. I'm not sure how much it wanted. But there we go. Oh, that's the old basha. A little anticlimactic about that. But, you know, what you gonna do? Oop. Let's not cancel the animation this time. Ooh. Ooh, zap zappy. We got it now. Aha. Alright. And what else did I need? I have all the things for this Manor El Mark II. I probably don't have anything else in my inventory helpful for me though. Diamond plates are in the vehicle, which is about to run out of fuel. That was the other thing I was going to do. Oh, I found it. Ah, oh, and it's, it's in pure iron, but that was the iron that's near the coal, which is over th that way. There is two, maybe three of them. That I can kind of use it in that regard. Getting into this thing is obnoxious. Um... I just drove over here and realized, let's see that, that guy, I realized I just don't know how I drove over here in the first place. So, let's go for a little tumble, whoosh, ouch. <laughs> uh, I knocked out, I destroyed a, a, a berry plant, get out of that. You stop, I do not trust myself to go across this. Especially when there's a bop bop on the other side of it. And we'd like it to be at least too wide. It's perfect. Why did I look down? That made no sense. Uh, but let's uh, build ourselves minor Mark II. Let me put it this way. Other thing I did not even see. 140 a minute. Um, 120 is your base rate, but because this is a pure coal, it's 140. Again, don't remember what the other one was. Um, but there's a slug over there too. Um, so I would need these belts, and that's just that'll be perfect. And I don't have something. What don't I have for the belt? It, it looks like I have everything. Confused. But that one. That one I can build. Or I forget. Let's double check if the iron was the one that's up there. There's four nodes round. There's some over there too. Okay, I'm going to check those out before I do anything else. Well, the, the two that I missed. Ignore that. And while I do so, we shall grab the green power slug that is up here. That I could just park all my way up here for. Where were the other two iron notes? Now they're over here. Need to urge the queer. I know it's cliff as well. Aha! We have a normal one. I'm guessing two, two normals because I don't have things on the top of them. Guessing normal is as good as these ones get? I don't, I don't know. Which makes going over there pretty easy. So the other, so the next question is, where about? You know what, I'm gonna do something real fancy. Of course by fancy I meant, I meant smart. I was gonna build a tower, I'm one rod short of building a tower. Um. Where do I convene, merge these things into a factory? Like, I could probably do it up here. Chop down the trees. Let's see, I want to use these two. Is a... I can't check from here without a, a table. Pretty cool. Let's go over there one day. Um, but yeah. I guess... we we'll probably try and... Get that up here. Just do a little factory here and then get into the 
the cut the vehicle and have it going back and forth because we can do that we haven't done that yet not too sure how about i want to do this i'd like to get different vantage points essentially also if i just take in the vehicle over there because i have a crafting bench in here I could have just built my tower that way. Organization? You got tower? Yeah. Not as tall as I would like it to be, actually. <laughs> this is going to work perfectly. Maybe. I... Well, it's probably not as close as I should have put it. Climb up to the top. It's a yellow power slug. Uh... Yeah, unless I want to not jump, I hit my head. Again, me looking up. Um, unless I built it up here. Although I don't need, probably need one of those nodes, really. Again, it depends. It's No, it's an even ratio. Never mind. Again, probably I only just need one. Either I could build here, or I could build up there. Again, or up here. I need to build this closer so I can just grab the... Actually, no. I can, uh... Just do that. Jump! Nummy, nummy, nummy. Yellow power slug. Alright, guys. Well, I think... I'm not too sure how long this episode is. I've recorded for about three hours. Uh, I think majority of it was still working on that. Um... Depending on the length of the video, there's either going to be a cut here or will be a time skip, actually. Or, or this will be the actual end of it. Um, but regardless, next thing we're going to be working towards is obviously getting level 3 belts. Uh, but that requires motors, which I just had a look at. So the motor needs a rotor, which is fair enough. And it also needs these stated... Uh, Stators, stators, which requires steel pipes, then doing good, yada yada yada. So, I think I'll actually more focus on proper steel production next episode. This episode could either be really short, I doubt that, or same length as normal, because that's what last episode ended up being pretty much. Uh, yeah, also notice that it didn't do the scanning for that. But also notice that the power shards are actually separate, which I might as well convert them into more of the pretties. It has 12 in a total. Yeah, you have 10. Wait, let me notice that I need for that. I need 50. Damn, it's not going to cheese our way through that one. But yeah, again, don't know if we're going to keep that. Actually, let's go have a look at the how much has been produced. Also, this will be where we will end it off. Yeah, I'm going to say this is just going to be where we're going to end today instead of trying to whoop, do a weird time jump and everything. Do -do -do -do. Let's see what we made. That's a what? Nearly four stacks of that, so this one will be close if yeah, that one's just over. And we still have the ones down there as well. Which is pretty good. I think I'm gonna end up doing what a lot of other people have done and move out into this big open area, because it's it's pretty flat. Or maybe over there? Not too sure where I should go. Yeah, it's just that steel production, whether I want to make it and bring it over. I don't know whether I pointed out that one's the yellow slot power slug too. Need to grab that at some point. Um But whether or not to make it over there or just transfer it like I'm doing with the coal. Because what I would what I do what I probably should do is is eventually we'll remove all of that. I don't think we'll ever connect the lines into the to this huge thing. You look weird. Uh, probably because of my settings. Um, I'll probably just move stuff into that. I might even move that down here as well. Not sure. 
And then, like, up there would be just a giant power grid. The now. Because I, I do know there's better stuff in the future. But anyway, guys, yeah, I'm going to leave the episode here. I stand on the cliff of this building. I both love and hate this building. I more or less hate the rock. Uh, that rock, in particular. Well, I, I suppose I could have brought this part out further. Because it's very tight space up here. It's only, what, three, three of these wide? Four in that case. It probably wants to be more... Probably one more wider. But then I'm, I probably would have been fine. But anyway. I'm rambling like normal. Uh, I shall see you guys next time. And we shall do the steel stuff then. Even though today we're supposed to do it today. But stuff happens. Anyway guys. I shall see you guys in the next episode. If you liked it. If you liked this episode. You should stick around and see some more. And I shall see you guys in the next one. But until then. Bye.